My name is Jackie Moore and I'm the Deputy Art Advisor with the Office of Public Works and my responsibility is to manage the State Art Collection. So we are delighted that uh, David Rooney's uh, drawings uh, have become part of the State Art Collection and we were able to facilitate the commissioning of these drawings through the Percent for Art scheme. So we use the Percent for Art generated by the refurbishment of Kilmainham Jail to acquire these drawings for the state. I'm James Quinn, I'm the managing editor of the Dictionary of Irish Biography, which is a research project of the Royal Irish Academy. Uh, we decided that we wanted to commemorate the Rising in some way, so we have an abundance of material to do it with, the dictionary having over 10,000 lives of people from Irish history. So we selected a number of these, the, the ones we felt that were most relevant to 1916, and uh, 42 lives in all, and uh, consisting of uh, 21 of the insurgents from the Rising, uh, nine women, um, a number of other nationalists, some people representing the British side, and the Lord Lieutenant, Chief Secretary and so on, some British military figures, and to round it off, a couple of historians. And David came on board, which have massively enhanced the book. Well, the, the, the exhibition comprises of 42 portraits, and they're done in a scraper board, so that's, that's the technique. It involves, um, it's a board that's covered with chalk, and the uh, chalk is covered with ink, and I engrave with a scalpel blade to reveal the white underneath, so it's a, there's a process of revealing in it. So the figures come to life out of the darkness. I've learned over the years to, what, what I need to do is kind of get out of the way and let the, let the image come to me rather than go and chase it. With these, the one problematic figure for me was, was De Valera. I couldn't see the, 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 the revolutionary behind that, that, that man, you know, uh, which he obviously was, and so I had to kind of revisit it. I chose as the uh, inspiration a, uh, a photograph that was taken shortly after, after he was arrested, and he seems to stand a head taller than the two uh, British soldiers who are guarding him, who look more nervous than he does, you know, and th that was the figure that I then chose to uh, represent and using Boland's Mills in the, in the background. You know. 42 beautifully illustrated drawings uh, by artist David Rooney on exhibition here adds a very rich dimension to the visitor experience at Kilmainham Jail in this centenary year. As Chairman of the Office of Public Works, I'm very proud of this collaboration between the Office and the Royal Irish Academy in making this happen. The portraits are a welcome asset to the State Art Collection and while many of you will have seen some of the portraits to the city, whether on the Dart or on the Dublin bus or in the Irish Times 1916 supplement, this is the first time these original drawings have been displayed together. A friend actually said to me last night that your portraits will probably be wheeled out again in a hundred years' time. And, uh, and it got me thinking as to what that, what that g gathering might be like. And, um, if it happens, and, and also what kind of Ireland will they see reflected in these portraits? Because um, I'm sure that as well as, as reflecting the past, these carry hidden in them uh, uh, a reflection of, of our time and uh, a reflection of all of us. So thanks very much and uh, enjoy the evening. Thank you.